Hey everybody, it's Stephen Get Money Myrick here. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing a little bit of life lessons in regard to Idol Heroes. Mistakes I have made that hopefully you can learn from. So hopefully, get out your little notepads, get ready to take some notes, because I'm going to talk about a big mistake I made with Transcendence Heroes and how I'm regretting it right now. Before going further, I do want to say if you're not subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing. But let's go ahead and talk about this mistake I made. And it involves choosing Asmodel over Star Wing Jara. Now, I just got... 5 million crystals of transcendence and I did just v4 my Asmodel and look at this stud look at how great he looks well you can't see him he's invisible but we've got him he's there and I'm happy with him and I'm happy we got him but what we don't have is a Starwing Jara and what I really want right now is a Starwing Jara so that we can do some Vanquisher levels on the Void Vortex and so I kind of want to talk about the mistakes I made leading up to this that led to there was being no chance I could get Starwing Jara and how I limited my options and how you can learn from that mistake. So if you remember when Starwing Jara was released there was a quest to unlock her 10 star avatar. You needed to build a 10 star and you could get certain rewards and I did that. So I had a 10 star uh, Jara sitting in my bag for a healthy amount of time. And the way the meta was shaken out in the last few weeks, Jara had fallen off big time in my mind. She was a paperweight, wasn't doing a ton in PvP, and there were a lot of you know sustained lineups being built that weren't even using her at all. And I looked at my Jara and I looked at my 10 star and I looked at, oh look, at all these heroes I could imprint and get a V1 imprint on and help me in the Void Arc. And I said, there's just no way I'm building Jara. And I fed away my 10 star Jara copy. And on top of that, when I did that, I only have four copies in the bag, so I can't even build one. And I was not thinking about the future and the fact that Jara could be useful in the future and that I didn't want to restrict my options on what I could do. What can you learn from this? Well, I'm basically just saying hoard every single hero you ever get. No, that's, that's not true. But I am kind of illustrating the significance of how the meta can change and how you can try and prevent uh, mistakes and how you can help yourself. You know, at the end of the day, did I need that 10 star jar of copy to feed her? No. On this account, I don't. You can see I have extra 10 star copies I can't even use right now. Maybe I could have fed Cthulhu. Why did I keep Cthulhu? Because I liked him and I just figured there was no way I, I was building Starwing Jara anytime soon at least. And then I added on to this mistake because what I did next is I had, I used to have two Adas and about Three days ago, I was like, okay, you're getting close to Asmodel. Let's go ahead and swap one of those Adas to a E5 Asmodel. And once I did that, it really, really pulled the trigger on the fact that I need to go for Asmodel as my next Transcendence Hero, and I can't afford to wait around for copies of Jara because it is a PO event this week. I could have maybe gone in and tried to get Jara, get some copies there and built her, but the fact that I also had an E5 Asmodel that would be sitting around forever also just felt absolutely terrible to do. Yeah, I just kind of want to make this video. Maybe you can laugh at me, maybe cry with me. And at the end of the day, I still think Asmodel is probably better in PvP right now than Jara. It just feels awful to not have Starwing Jara and it feels awful to not be able to use her in Void Vortex and come in and get these rewards in Vanquisher. I don't even know what they're used for. I mean, I know they're for Celestial Island. We don't even know how rare this is, but it sure feels exclusive as hell right now. And we can't get that. And on top of that, see this leaderboard here? You see a bunch of Mobius, a bunch of Hell players, and you see Relic. This is Relic right here. This is Server 13. This could have said, get money Myrick here. That could have been me. And there's something very special about that. It, it's there for the end of time and it's gone now. And I need to live with that fact. I need to live with the decisions I made. And but it just felt bad. It just felt really bad. And I wanted to talk about this and make you all feel bad with me, but also specifically talk about keeping your options open with an Isle Heroes. Now, that being said, if we get the copies for Starwing Jara, can we use our Soul Stones and swap Asmodel to Jara? Absolutely. Will we do that? Possibly. We'll have to see how the meta shakes out and specifically what is needed for Void Vortex. But the big takeaway from this video is do not feed hero copies of Transcendence Heroes, regardless of the fact that you don't think you're building one soon. It feels bad. It feels really, really bad. I wanted to talk about it. Hopefully you can learn from my mistakes. Do not feed your copies of Vesa. Do not feed any copies you have of Aspen. You know, we want to be saving on to those. And I think most of you know that, and I should have known better. I should have known there was an update, but this is what I did. These are the choices I made with. And all I can do is live with the fact that I have a Asmodel. I mean, look at this guy. He barely does anything against other lineups. 
Honestly though, with energy feed right now and with having a Kroos, it feels like I am cheating uh, within PvP. So there is that advantage, specifically against people that don't have disruption. I mean, just look at this. And you know what? Maybe Asmodel wasn't that bad of a decision. Maybe they weren't that bad to go with. Makes you think. But that's all I have in this video. I wanted to talk about this mistake. I thought you might find the story interesting. Maybe you could learn something from it. And I will see you all in my next one.